here's the reaction to the results. Uh, the smile says it all. The headline, Merkel's biggest triumph. But it's the smile that says it. I mean, it's a complete and utter victory. There's no doubt about that. And if you're wondering what it means for business, well, the big losers last night were the, they're always called the pro-business Free Democrats. They're completely out. They have no seats in the new parliament. So you wonder what the complexion of the new government will be. It will be obviously Chancellor Merkel, who will see it as a vindication of her economic policy. And she'll probably have to look for new partners, probably the Social Democrats. So a slight movement of the government towards the left. Uh, the SPD campaigned for a minimum wage, for example, for more protection for workers. It may secure some of that as its concession to get to take part in, in a new government. So a slight movement to the left, but a continuity of economic policy broadly. I was going to say, because, I mean, we talked about the fact that the Eurozone debt crisis, her handling of that has helped her enormously in this election. But also, the economy is not in bad shape. The unemployment rate is the lowest in two decades. Generally speaking, the German economy has been faring well compared to many economies in Europe that have had a very difficult time. Compared to is the crucial phrase in what you just said. Remember, growth is going to be maybe 1% this year. And there were times when we would have thought that 1% was very, very low and very, very poor. But you're absolutely right. Uh, we have had a Eurozone in recession. We've had a Europe in recession. And Germany has stayed with its head just above water, if you like.